Nine people are in hospital after emergency services were called to a suspected mass drug overdose in Perth. It's believed the property was being used to house for backpackers and students. Neighbours woke to emergency services swarming their suburban street, shaken by what they saw. We came outside because it was we heard some loud noises and when we came out, uh, just heaps and heaps of police cars and ambulances, eight ambulances. They had like glassed eyes and they're all just in like a different world. It was so scary to look at. Seven men and two women were taken to hospital. Police say a white powdered drug was found at the property and has been sent to the State Chemistry Centre for analysis. Three of the victims are in the intensive care unit at Royal Perth Hospital. The important thing is that medical help is seeked as soon as, they're, um, as, soon as they, they are unwell because if it wasn't for the timely um, call of the other uh, resident who, at the home, these patients, some of them would have inevitably have died. The property is believed to be a backpacker house. Locals reported seeing victims convulsing on stretchers as paramedics rushed them from the home. They say it's not the first time there have been issues with this property, with emergency service in attendance last weekend. Neighbours reported safety concerns to the local council several times, resulting in an investigation in 2016. Testing publicly available. This event highlights the need for Australia to join the rest of the international community and engage in drug checking. Some of those who overdosed have been released from the hospital, but the medical service warned against taking the incident lightly. Several of them have had to be put in a medically induced coma for their own protection, and I really need to emphasise how seriously unwell they were. Kyle Brown, SBS World News.